Welcome back to We Got the Hearts. Yeah, we got the hearts. Yay, we're gonna belly flop over here, because that was a very obvious thing. What do we got? A sick nug. We still have no idea what they're for. I assume I sell them later. Oh. Uh, can, you can you turtle? <gasps> That's... Can you turtle? Turtle higher. Oh, start from higher? Oh, yeah. We've discovered a new puzzle solution, didn't we? No? Nope. We did not. Okay. Well, I guess we go the other way then. Yep. Do, 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 do. I like this music. Did Danny Baranowski write this? Uh, I don't know. I don't know who did the music for this. <laughs> or Vert. One of them, I mean, I mean 50% me of, up real quick not really, 50% of any games. Where do you think we should go? They said all the way to the right. Should I just make my way up, or should I make my way right, you think? Um, I would say that you should go in the direction of... <laughs> totally not reading a walkthrough or anything. No, not suspicious at all. Um, What's bring, bring, up, bring up the map real quick. I knew there was stuff in this room. Hold on. There's secret owl statues. Yeah, there are secret owl statues. Where do you think I should go? Can you zoom in? Uh, yes, I can. Oh, wow. Yeah, look at all that zoom in. I mean, I can just bump up against walls until I find a, a break, brick I can open up. What so. is that blue? I don't know. I don't remember. Let's find out. Oops, I forgot to open up a thing. Excuse, excuse me, lady. Do not throw your fish eggs at me. Oh, oh it's, it's the teleport room. Yes, we definitely want to go to this. Do we want to go, go to this? Go, go, no, go back to town real quick. Okay. Because you have, like, max money and need to spend it real quick. Oh, I do have max money. Wow. And you can also get some hearts. I don't. Well, I don't know if that's actually max money, but, like, you know, may as well go spend it real quick. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and I can visit the the squid smith. And I think they, she did say just go to the east side of the island. So I think I'm good to just go east. We're going to fill in this game later if we fill in this game. We're just going to yeah. off the branch or we're going to do, like, maybe we'll finally stream or... Oh, oh, excuse me. Yes, hello. Visitors uh, once saw a ghost ship off the coast near Treetown. Some say it's not together to see grave. Oh, okay. Could they there really be a second? Uh, haven't we already checked that out? No, we have not. Okay, so we have two directions to go now. Um, that that is the direction that we are trying to go, and yes, this is the lady that we. I thought we said to. it was on the east side. It's on the west side. Uh, I'm trying to. Where's figure Armor that out. Town? I think this is Armor Town, but uh, buy buy spells and stuff. Okay, well, those are all taken, so yeah, I guess I'll just up my spells that I already own, because that's what I said I was going to do last time, didn't I? Yeah. Alright, buy that. Buy Scimitar. And then I guess I can start, which one do you think, Super Bowl or Homing Rocket? Um, I think Homing Rocket's probably going to be like the DPS, there's like that single target boss you want to beat the shit yeah. out of. Yeah, sounds, sounds like a good idea. Yeah, we can buy two levels of it? Yeah, and let's not buy the Super Bowl, because once again, I, I don't want You don't want to buy Kyrena. Bubble? Huh? You don't want to buy Bubble? What's Bubble? I don't know. Oh, no, because once again, I don't want to have too many uh, spells, you know. The more spells I have to cycle through, the less happy I am, you know? Um. Speaking of, I should have used spells on that last fight, huh? That would have been smart. Okay, where's our heals? I gotta heal up. Like, look how hurt I am. So very hurt. Alright, Squidsmith, where'd you go again? I don't remember where she is. To the left. Is this her? Yeah. Oh. Hey! I think you have enough for two. No... Yes, yes, I know what you do. I've heard your thing. Is that a new sound effect? No. Huh. Shows how much attention I was paying during the Gallagher segment. <laughs> Someone, like, independently, I think they hadn't... Um, XR, yeah, I already know. Yeah. Somebody, I don't think they noticed that you had already pointed out that it was like, Hey, it's the Gallagher bit, but with heart squids. So they, like, mentioned it in the comments. Five yeah. episodes later. All right, where do you think I should go? Oh, okay, I, I I figured out what the hell this thing is saying now. Go go warp room. Go to the warp room. Okay. Yeah. Where's that warp room? Uh, to the right. Uh, is it? Oh yeah yeah that's right that's right outside of town here. Oh yeah. They put it off to the side. Go yeah. to the leftmost warp. That's what it was saying. Okay. Is this Armor Town? No. Oh okay. We're gonna get to Armor Town. <gasps> We're gonna get to Armor Town on this episode on the branch. I hope. Where we talk about, like, all of YouTube's deep, dark, awful secrets, or at least the worst creators on YouTube's deep, dark, awful secrets that were not secrets at I'd all. I'd, like, left and down -ish. Am I being vague enough? No. I finally figured, found out who the fuck Shane Dawson is by... Who the fuck is Shane he Dawson? He was so terrible, I, I, he finally popped up on my radar. Okay, so, my understanding of who this guy was initially was, he's just some douche tuber that applies, you know, that, that... You know how, like, Jake and Logan Paul are? He's like that, but specifically for tween girls. Okay. Yeah, he's a shitty douche tuber 
that's that's addicted to people, and it turns out he was a pedophile all along. Which what a twist. we're gonna find out is not a twist at all to anyone who was paying attention. So, the guy started. Oh hey hey, I remember mermaids. Guy started his YouTube career like ten years ago or something, which is funny because I guess he was supposedly popular then. I just never heard of him because, again, I watch YouTube for good content, not for crap content, uh, garbage repeat filler. shovelware filler content like the stuff we make or or like what those sort of people do. And uh, yeah, it turns out. I, I mean, John, no, we, we there, make quality content. There are here. interviews of podcasts of him going back for years saying stuff like. Man, I sure would just... Oh, I can't even repeat some of the stuff he says. Let's just say he implies, he implies that that he really would like to just start doing sexual things with his 12-year-old fans. Why? And he brings it up a lot. And he tries to frame it as a joke. But everyone around him can tell it's not a joke. And they're like, ooh, please stop. Because they know Shane Dawson. And they know he's talking about how he wants to fuck little girls. And it is creepy as fuck. It's all over the internet. He's been saying it for years, and I don't understand. Like, there's, there's. I, I mean, we talked about cancel culture on on uh, Metroid Fusion. This is where it's valid to cancel someone when they very clearly should not be in public because it, like, you start putting the p puzzle pieces together, and they're not hard. This is like a twenty piece puzzle. Okay, it's it's it only takes a minute. You know, it's yeah. It's a it's a distracting game for children. It is not something that should be difficult for you to figure out. Uh, it's very clear that he, his entire career has been about trying to attract and groom preteen girls. Because that's what he's into. Oh boy, which is why he looks like, you know, what you... A pedophile? Well, think about if you're going to, to mold someone with... The, I, I'm going to try bottom right first. You're going to try to mold, sculpt a golem, a human golem. Ew. That, that, uh... That is the perfect tween girl bait. And Shane Dawson very clearly... Just look at the fucking guy. Like, like don't show a picture of him because he's gross. But, uh... <laughs> just... You look at the guy's face from five years ago and you're like, Oh, that's why he looks like that. Because that's what 12-year-old girls find attractive. Let me... And, and, uh, really? They find this attractive? Yeah, that is very much. Like, that, like bo that boy's haircut... That we're talking about like middle class suburban white girls who have their own iPhone and they're on YouTube. So I mean, they could do so much better than this. this is well, like... like also, I don't know which picture you're looking at because he's he's put on and lost weight a um, bunch of times. Here, that one, those couple. Oh yeah, oh those are some. Those of the are like those are some pictures. of the uglier ones. Yeah, yeah, those are the those are the. I was gonna say the driver's license photos, but I think you nailed it with the prison picture because you. Boy, because he's on radar now. This is a guy with millions of subscribers, I guess. I don't know how. He's just an asshole on the internet, and that gets you, makes you popular. I'm an asshole on the internet, but nobody likes me. I, I can't figure it out. Um. Well, because you're not a pedophile, obviously. So. <laughs> if I was, I'm if not going after gone, the right audience. I found the secret to our success. By the way, you should do a Healy dance. Yes, I should. But um, I'm getting shot at still. Um. All you have to do is secretly become a pedophile. Don't let anyone know, but just like hint at it like crazily, and and, and make sure like everybody I know that know everybody that knows me in real life uh, knows that I'm being serious and not joking about it, and but, it gets extremely uncomfortable every time I bring it up. Yeah, yes. yeah, like that's exactly all you have to do, and then we'll be popular as hell. Yeah. Follow up story, Amareth. Follow up story. Why are so many pedophiles into Smash? Like, Smash have you heard about this? Yeah, no. well, not just, sorry, it's not just pedophiles. Uh, sorry, sexual predators. Like, Smash is apparently where you go if you're a sexual predator to play competitive video games. Because <laughs> it seems like there are over something like 100 competitive players have now been outed for things like sexual assault and really bad harassment. And Look, look it up. There's going to be a mega document somewhere. Sure. If, you, if you've got the multitasking to do it between, like, while I you're... Don't. Okay, well, we're playing. What, these guys are just all awful. You think this is the way I'm supposed to go? Uh... Maybe. I'm hoping. I feel this feels like I've entered a higher level area than I'm supposed to be in, but I guess they're not destroying me. I've got heal spells. Oh, you should and... pull. You should try out like the the homing missiles, some of the new spells. Oh yeah, I should, huh? Okay. <laughs> he still blocks them. Can you? Can you not? Hey, hey, you can know you what? Not be so crabby. Okay. <laughs> there, he's not so crabby anymore. Yeah, you still. We've gotten crab. the golden crab. Oh wait, why am I doing that? I have. Oh, because I need the magic too, right? Yeah. We'll argue. No, okay. your your attack will not get longer if you keep jumping, John. 
No, I was trying to, to barely hit... Oh, of course I'm going to take tank one of those fish eggs or whatever they are. So I have no idea where I'm supposed to be going. Up, grab that treasure chest, whatever it yeah, is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I bet it's a nug. It's yeah. a nug! I wonder if this is just part of 100% completion. It does I nothing. don't know what those nuggets are for, honestly. What, did, was there anything in that room? Yeah, there was a way down. Oh, okay. Oh, wow. I'm glad everything respawns. That sure is... Uh, nice. Yeah. Oh, okay. Probably ways mm. down I can't go. Gee, I wonder if we're about to finally get that, that next the fusion. The water ability? Yeah. Oh, apparently I could not just dash straight through here. Well, apparently dashing through her like, did like a daisy stun. Okay. And I don't mean daisy like, hi, I'm daisy. <laughs> So, um, yeah, uh, apparently a lot of uh, Smash players are very bad people. There are a ton of I'm, allegations going around. So many that some of them have to be true at a bare minimum. It basically um, amounts to, I would say, that there's bad people in every community. It's yeah. Which one you're hearing about. Smash is having us me too. Oh, no. Please don't tell me it's coming to Rando. Um, uh, well, we, we did have that one incident. <laughs> <laughs> Mr. White Pride Worldwide. <laughs> yeah, we did talk about that, I believe. I think that's come up on the brush, but it's a good enough topic to come up again, especially because yeah. it, it it comes to another thing I've been trying to convince you of that you finally kind of talked me down from. What was that? Is a bad idea. Well, um, oh right, because yeah. I was I'm really into the idea of I'm, I'm a big old attention whore. Why do you think I'm on the branch? You know, that's and hey, oh, hey yay, cool. We got our new warp room. I like people watching me. I like being people. Oh, oh. So, uh, who's saying? Who said that? Yeah, who said that? Who said Siren be gone? Ooh, I'm a go. Oh, Merith, you gotta come up with something. I, I gotta? Yeah, can you come well, up with something? I fear you not. There we go, good enough. I have no life left to take. Ellipses, what is this? You are no Siren? Good, good, good call there. I'm a half genie. Ah, Genie! What a More like... I don't know. Down here? <laughs> oh. Where's your other half? Exactly! <laughs> half Genies are daughters of Genies! Why can't they be... Why can't they why be can't sons they be of Genies? Why can't they be sons of... Uh, yeah, or boy Genies. Like, I came here looking for my friends! Well, why can't there be the male Genie sons? They were captured children. by sirens, and now I've got to find them. Can you help me? I will go. Maybe you speak the truth. Maybe you're bullshitting. Who knows? A siren trick. Yeah, exactly. One way to know for certain. Do a good deed. As only a genie would. Because genies are known for doing good deeds. <laughs> Never have I ever heard of a genie doing anything bad. Ever. Deed. Do you want a lap dance? <laughs> like, like what? what? <laughs> Let me bend over. <laughs> Return my scary doll to me. Precious gift, family keepsake. But it was lost. Long ago when I crashed onto this island. Here, go give me this airplane. fucking thing. Go find my MacGuffin. The guardian genie is always on duty. I have time for your pointless fetch quest. Look at my butt. I'll return your doll to you. You certainly seem like an honest one. Why? But we'll see about that. <laughs> Take this. <sighs> hey! Well, oh. We got Yay. just a random fusion stone from not a whole that? fusion stone. I thought we we only got those from half genies. The only thing I value, I've managed to hold on to, and now I've lost it. All right, so so we're gonna get a thing. He's gonna give us thing. What's the fusion stone do? Or does it? Do we have to? Well, like, we gotta give the fusion stone obviously to um, Spiky Hair McGee. Oh right, so we gotta go find her, and then and then this guy will let she, us pass. She's off in the who knows what. Which land. is funny because oh no, I guess we didn't come from the other side. Okay, uh, well it's it's an armor town. Uh yeah, in the in the, in the main town. Let's go give her the fusion stone. Okay. In central town, and see what um electrical dance we get from her probably. <laughs> okay. <laughs> The lightning summoning Oh, song. yeah, yeah. Uh, I guess the short version of it is uh, there was a guy who felt uh, uh, some people were saying changing their, their Twitch names to things like Black Lives Matter, trying to show, you know, some support. Like, hey, you know, uh, may maybe maybe a little bit maybe of politics is okay here. You know, some, some universally agreed on these people are being deprived of their rights and we should do something about that politics. Right. Well, first, not there. And uh, this guy said, well, I don't like this because nobody would let me talk talk about my political agenda in here. 
And everyone's like, what's that? What political agenda would that be, Mr. Racist probably incoming? And he basically said, well, I believe that white people are superior to all other races, and I should be allowed to say that if you're allowed to say Black Lives Matter. Woo, right. he got out of there real quick, he? Didn't got, he? Like, Where am I supposed to go? The to book? the right. This Up one? and right, this yes. One? Well, they don't label any of the doors. No, okay, she's not there, okay. Yep. She did say at the western end of the island, didn't, they? didn't she? She said Armor Town. Yeah, this is not Armor Town, is it? You said that this was Armor Town. No, I specifically said I don't think so. They kept saying on the west end of the island or the east end of the island. No, that's what I said. And you kept Go telling me was. no. Yeah, I was saying that this is not Armor Town. No, you said. We can go John. back and show you saying that this was no, Armor Town, not. and you kept saying I should teleport here. All right, is this Armor Town? It, it, I bet this is Armor Town. Okay, here we go. Warp back to town and head all the way right and up to reach Armor Town. Ah, oh, it is on the east side of town like I originally thought. And you're like, west, but that's because we had to go west. and you were Because they said west for the, you know the what, good Marath ship. I'm pulling over. We're stopping John. for directions. Next time on the branch. No, like... <laughs>